In this video, we're going to enable uh, choose profile for the button and let user select their profile for the from a photo library. And the way it will work is this. User will tap on um, choose profile photo. They will be presented with their photos. Um, they will select one of their photo and the uh, image uh, picker view controller will be uh, dismissed and profile photo will be set to our uh, image view here on, in the left top corner. Okay, so um, let's go ahead and create this um, um, code. Um, I have um, main storyboard open on my uh, window and the very first thing that I need to do is I need to create a custom class for my uh, sign up um, view controller. We have created user interface, but we did not create um, a custom class that will be responsible and handle um, operations for this view controller. And the way to check if you do have or do not have custom class for this view controller created is you select uh, the view controller here and then on your utilities panel go in um, identity inspector and you will see whether there is uh, uh, a custom class provided. The um, I clearly do not have anything in here. So I will expand my right side panel. I'll go to my uh, new app, new file and uh, iOS source Kako touch class next and um, under subclass of I will select uh, view controller and I will give it a name sign up view controller next create okay so the view controller is created I will uh, copy its name and then go back to main storyboard select view controller and under identity inspector I can either paste the name or I can start typing and Xcode should, should uh, auto suggest me sign up view controller and uh, while we are here for identity storyboard ID I also like to use just the same name sign up view controller we need identity storyboard ID so that we can instantiate this uh, view controller when we need it from the source code using the uh, identity ID. So I like to keep this two uh, the same. Okay, now uh, the view controller is created, the custom class is created. I can uh, go on to the um, assistant editor. I'll open it and hide on the left side panel as well and start writing my uh, Swift code. Okay, so the very first thing that we need to do is we need to create an outlet for image view. I will select image view, hold command button, click, hold, I mean, control button, click, drag, and drop here. And I will create, uh, I'll call it profile, profile, photo, image view okay an outlet is created and i need to create uh, one more outlet for the select photo button but that outlet will be of action type uh, control click drag and drop and it will be connection type action and the name will be select profile photo button tapped something like this so it should be uh, an action uh, outlet okay so when user taps on this button this function will be called and we need to present user with an image picker view controller for image picker view controller to work our um, our custom class or this uh, sign up view controller should conform to a um, couple of delegates uh, and um, I will put a dot here and uh, I will uh, the, the very first delegate uh, that we need to uh, add is called UI image picker controller delegate UI image picker controller delegate and the second delegate is called UI navigation controller delegate
okay? So um, now when we have these two delegates, I can uh, hold command button on my keyboard and click on, and click on UI picker, uh, picker controller delegate. It will take me to the uh, delegate and it will show me some functions that I uh, can implement to make this um, image picker control delegate work. And I'm interested in the very first function. It is optional, but we still need to implement it. It's called image picker controller did finish picking MIDI information, MIDI with info. So I'll copy it, go back to my code, uh, scroll a little bit down and paste it here. I will delete the optional. I don't need it and we'll add function body. Okay, so um, now when um, user taps on uh, this uh, select profile photo button, uh, these function select profile photo button will be called and we can now instantiate our um, uh, UI picker controller and I will create a new variable called I'll call it my picker controller equals UI image picker controller okay um, now we can uh, we need to set its delegate to self and we need because there are a couple of ways to uh, uh, let users select um, the photo. We need to provide source type, and um, the way we uh, choose source type, if it is we use UI image picker controller source type, UI image picker controller source type, and when I tap on uh, dot uh, there are a couple of ways i see uh, i can use camera or for the library i will choose photo library okay and the last thing that i need to do i'll just give it uh, a little more space so that um okay and the last thing that i need to do i need to present this view controller so i'll say self present um view controller it's going to be my picker controller animated true and completion nil. There is uh, nothing I want to do once it starts up. Um, okay, uh, so um, uh, we have uh, it's complaining something about cannot assign uh, assign view controller to self. my delegate equals self UI image picker controller delegate UI navigation controller we have an error here and this is why we have I I, 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 I made a typo UI navigation control delegate the n was uh, lowercase so I've corrected that and the error is now gone Okay, so uh, when a user taps on a button, this function is called and um, we instantiate image picker controller. We uh, set the delegate to self and we specify the source type and we present user with a picker controller. So now when user selects an image, this function will be called. Uh, and it will be called because we said the delegate is this view controller. And uh, when um, um, user selected image, we need to uh, set it to our profile uh, photo image view. So I'll copy a variable name, scroll down here to my function, and I'll say profile uh, photo image view dot image equals. And um, this function will um, uh, pass to us an info object. That info object will contain information about the image. And uh, it's um, uh, an array and the way we can access image is to look for UI image picker controller original image. So I will start typing UI image 
picker and hopefully Xcode will auto suggest um, picker controller original image yes so and that will return us an image a UI image okay so the image will be set and the last thing that we need to do we need to dismiss the uh, image picker controller so I'll say self dismiss view controller animated true and completion nil um, okay so I think this is it let's just delete this comment here save it and I think it should work um, let us just double check we've created image view we've created uh, a button set an outlet and when the button is stop we present image picker view controller uh, let user select image and then we dismiss uh, view controller and we set the image to our uh, profile for the image view oh, everything should be okay let's run and see how it works okay our application is up and running i will tap on sign up button and then present it with the sign up view controller then i'll tap on select profile photo and then present it with a photo library i'll go and pick one of the pictures and the picture is um, set up into our image view and image picker view controller is dismissed let's select a different picture for example this one everything is working okay so we're done with this video